an incredible impact on this beach pro tour and that's one of the reasons why the option ball hitting of Miles Partain ever since that round of 12 match was decided. Oh, I was completely gutted for the Swedes as they had to pull out after they went down in that first set against USA. A serve from Sweden. And we know they are going to target Banesh. Good scramble from the USA, but here comes the option. It was always going to happen. Pressure against Herrera and Guevara of Spain before they came through 15-30. He's been working on a serve that can do the job, cutting it away to the perimeters. But goes mid-court this time on to David Orman. Good swing from Helvig. Well defended by Orman on that Partain shot. And then he comes back with his own sweet angle. Really good read. But the pick-up here from Orman coming in. It's given to you. And so that's where the errors creep in. Bang in. Swing, so they'll move into position early. That's good, that's good. That'll help out a little bit. So nice work from Banesh to get the point. It's a good set here from Partey, and he was in all kinds of pickle, but Andy Banesh is staying with him, just sticking to some solid one, two, three. Not big servers, they work their process of block and defense. Which means Sweden will be allowed to play those sets, but Andy Banesh has got his timing right at last. Defense becomes almost unpredictable. Let's see if Banesh goes on the option here. No, he's able to just get across to Helvig. Doing a really good job of breaking down Banesh's pass, so he's not able to get the consistency. That'll do. There's the sweep from Banesh down the line for the point. Good enough. Definitely one of his favoured moves, but again, it becomes a thing. Put his team back on level terms and he is not falling for anything Partain with a dramatic Superman dive but you can't <laughs> play against that that oh. is just amazing from Orman it was coming at him quite fast and to me you can often miss time this play but what a flying save by Partain but Orman reading the play fantastically oh beautiful <laughs> it's just brilliant. Replay, it's just the fact, did you see his left arm there? It cocked back a bit, and that is what sucked Helbig in. If that hand doesn't go backwards, then you don't suck the blocker. His hand's pressed over faster. Good work. Tain's still capable of producing the set. But what I loved here about Banesh, he just waited for the move from Orman. Stayed structured in. USA get control of the ball. They have the option. Oh, it's a good serve. That's a really good serve. Well passed by Banesh, though, and well hammered. Out of his shoulder, but just enough away thrown, enough of a risk. Doesn't get it to drop. Both the Americans go with the set, and Sweden are beaten in set one, 22-20. And they're making a hell of a noise. But the support for both of these teams has been pretty equal. USA with an incredible battle back to take the first set. They were put under murderous pressure, Denise, in the first set. Artane show. Oh, I, I mean, I felt sure they were going down. But the way they dug deep, the way they just kept on applying. USA looking for a fifth top four when they beat the beach volley vikings so the other volley vikings in mol and Sorum, the originals and a credit to both of them how deep they dug and their effective serving against the swedes great turn the tallest but light of frame so their power to weight ratio is just incredible and that's what wow you can see David Orman, he was looking for that onto option. He knew where he was going to get a read, but then Partain decides not to end where the USA night closer to the screen is quite problematic in terms of receiving those low float serves. Beautiful system that both these teams play. And 
everyone now getting used to the jump set, not really getting drawn in by it. Now, if you can take your eye off the ball, watch Miles Partain in defence here. Watch his movement behind Banesh. So he doesn't have to do too much there other than to come on the court and play it and then wrap it straight past the block. So handy. Oh, it's a cracking serve. Well handled by Sweden, but blasted out of play by David Ormond. To be a little bit higher on that right side to exercise that line a little bit more concisely. Well, Banesh overpasses and can't get back. Old school. And that's what Banesh can bring to the party. He's one of these. The play's on. Partain covers. And again, Holman makes the play. Away goes the hat from Banesh, but. And that one just slips away and slides to Holman. Sweden save it, though. And that is bounced right on the blue tape. On the lift, pull that trigger on the on two option. Tough pass for Banesh. Does really well. Back to Helvig. Option swing is as good as it gets. <laughs> he won't have time to get in for the option swing. So what's he going to do? Decides to go back to Orman. But Helvig also has the option in his armory. Two line blocks signalled. So Armand will sit in the pocket. And there's the sweep opportunity. Well read by Banesh. That was definitely a yours, no yours moment. Change up to Partain. Banesh hits the option. Not that convincing, but that is convincing from Partain. Defense and then that crossbody second ball option that Partain has brought in. But it's definitely cementing in it now. That is a really high reaching spike onto the baseline. USA staring down the barrel here. And this time the line is not open. Helvig has finally got his man on the sweep. Will the Swedish fans be celebrating in a moment? One point required. And there it is. Not the most convincing option swing, but it'll do. 21 16. This quarter final. flow of the game and the momentum that was different hey it worked don't knock it beautifully done with regard to the system both these teams are playing but it's whether you can execute it under pressure didn't fall for that at all where next for these two teams Little dipper. They've been using that serve effectively, but that's another beautiful pass. Orman knew that was coming. This makes the blocker not sure if it's going to come one way or the other. Beautiful. Which he does. Just sends it too long. Free net for Sweden. Jump set is obviously what I meant. You'll forgive my excitement because this has been something else. A few US fans in the crowd as well. But they've been outshouted by Sweden here. And USA on court just about being outplayed. Like the other volleyball Vikings, let's see if Banesh can do it at the net now. On to Helvig, cross block was the call. But no, there's that bit of game awareness from Jonathan Helvig. And that'll be good enough for a Final Four appearance on their return to the Beach Pro Tour. It's brilliant. It is just brilliant. USA played really well in that game, but Sweden were relentless. Thing alongside these young Swedes who really are taking this game to new, new, new heights, and the USA, they're hanging in there with them. Brilliant finish.